go. I be live again. Sorry about that. We had a visitor come over. And, um, yeah. So anyway, how you guys doing? I'm back. Mr. E. Groff looks like he's feeling better. Yeah. Yeah. I'm alright. He's a cute boy. I want to be a cute boy. You are a cute boy. You're the cutest of the boys. Good. Yes. My cute boy. I want to be <laughs> a cute boy. <laughs> I love you, my love. I love you more. Baby. I do. This is nice drinking it like this. Oh yeah, it's fucking Sunday. Sweet. Sunday fun day. The day we go in town, finally. I think the first thing I'll go to is Willie's. Because it's still 8.30. Oh, we'll go, we're going here first. Okay. It smells itself. He does sell and sell. Or smell and... and sell? Sell. Yeah, that. <laughs> Whatever. I don't remember anything in life. <laughs> what an eyesore. This is the Pelican Town Community Center. What's left of it anyway? It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. I know, man. Sad. Now just look at it. Shameful. These peep these days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. That's because people are fucking crazy, Lewis. Everything okay? Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Just someone came over. It's fine. We're okay. Yeah. That's good. But listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Joja Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. If anyone else buys a Joja Corp membership, I'm just gonna s s go ahead and sell it. Lewis? That means if you buy a membership from Joja Corporation, That building becomes fucking ugly. That's wrong. Mm hmm. Scourge you want to do the community center. The Junimals. For aesthetic reasons. Ah, uh, here, let's go inside. I will, mister. I will. I love you. That turned out to be really good. Yeah? Yeah. You had to, I had to stir it up. 
and get the ice. Milk. That's what you needed. You needed caffeine. Yeah, probably. Hmm, <laughs> what's this? I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. What? What's the matter? Are you ill? I'm seeing and hearing things. You saw something? Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. That's what you saw, a rat. It wasn't a ghost or a demon or, or a figment of your imagination, even. Hmm. Anytime, Billy. He said thanks, Rev. Well, oh, thank you. Now what? Ah, the Junimo. You're worrying me, Lona. Why? Look, I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. Me too. I need some lunch and dinner and dessert and second lunch. <laughs> That's a Lord of the Rings reference. Second lunch. Because I'm a nerd. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. <sighs> yeah, I'll, I'll catch that rat. Thanks, Lewis. Lewis is weird. Hi, maybe. Just someone came over. No biggies. Let me read this. I guess next Sunday we'll be visiting the Wicked Wizard of the West, I guess. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Stardew. Stardew. It's in an alien language that I do not know what it is. Mmm. You like that? You want to try it? Yeah, I'll try it. Oh my god. Try it again. I got a little scared because how the stream ended. That's amazing. Yeah. It's okay. I'm fine. Everything's good. Mmm. That is so good. It's really good. I love chocolate. This is good too. Is it gonna give you heartburn? That's the question. Most likely, I don't care. It's, I'll deal with it. It's worth the hot bomb, folks. I'm not gonna not drink it. <clears throat> It's Mayor Lewis's birthday. Let me see Javi. Javi, darling, baby. See, Loner knows the doctor is lonely. Okay, this is a plan. I'm going to make another stream where I'm going to try my best to get in his pants and marry him. <coughs> cool. Dr. Javi. Because he's a loner, too. He's a loner. Yeah, but he's got money, so I figured 
I got a well successful farm and and he has a well you know a, a well established medical facility we would be such a bomb like power couple mm -hmm. good call you know eventually you could open up a marijuana dispensary, dispensary. he looks like he would mm -hmm. he's got that look mm -hmm. stoner type and Dr. Harvey would so smoke pot. Mm hmm. Yep. Hi, honey. He's struggling to make end me. I don't have enough patience. People don't need the doctor. What's my favorite wrist song? I don't have one. Clint wants a Joja Cola. Hi, Pierre. What's up? I'm here to buy shit. I want some seeds. Can I buy some seeds from you? Alright, let's buy a bunch of seeds. We'll buy 20 of these. We'll buy. Ten of these. And we'll buy some of those. Ah! Foiled. <coughs> I guess next week we'll maybe get something going, I guess. All right. Oh, George, he's going to church. He goes to church every Sunday, that George fella here. That's a terrible gift. I didn't mean to give you a fucking gift. <laughs> That's a terrible gift. What dickwad? You know, here I am with a bunch of seeds and trying to conquer the world, and he's like, fuck you, bitch. Like, what's up with that shit? What an asshole. Shop. No, I don't want to shop. Oh, wait, I don't got money. I can't even do this. Fuck. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just go and... Give this dude a chicken. I think Can't Help Falling in Love with You is my favorite Elvis song. I can't help I think. falling in love with you. Yeah, that one. That one? I think that's my favorite. And I go to children, I don't know the lyrics, <clears throat> but I try to tell you that I have it all the way I try to do it for you, my lovey poo, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, okay, sorry, I just came up with a song in my head and went for it. I know I do that a lot. Pleasant. I have music in my head. This little song's right. I am. You're cute. You think I'm cute? Yeah, I think you're cute. Baby. <laughs> I do. You're sweet. I try to be. Yeah. No. But I get bitchy when I get hangry. I can't help that, man. I don't know what's fucking wrong with me. Blood sugar. Really? Yeah, I just hit the ground. But you, you get angry. Mm -hmm. Gunther. I get mega hangry. Remarkable. It's very old. 
I'd love to study this <coughs> in greater detail, but it is yours. Hmm, ladders. I think the brownie keeps getting stuck in it. Yeah, that I figured that would happen. So you take the top off and start eating it out of the top. You want me to eat the top? <laughs> yeah, you could do that. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> that's pretty hot. Yeah, that's hot. Have fun with a girl, you know. Nothing wrong with that. You want to see that so bad, bro. I love you. I love you. You're cute. You're cute. You're cute. You know what? I'm getting a migraine now. <laughs> it's that cold, isn't it, that we keep passing back and forth? Yeah, I think so. Ugh, oh, my nose is dripping. Uh, migraines are no laughing matter. They are in my sick fucking dark ass world. <laughs> uh. What is it, baby? What watermelon? Yeah. Is that right? You just ate foods. Did you get your food? She ate her food. Was it good food? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was good food. You like the food? Huh? You're your good girl. She is a good baby. You're your good girl. She's floofing. She is floofing. She's like, I was happy as I got full <coughs> bellies. Yeah. I got the full bellies. You got the vid? The vid of what? <laughs> COVID. Oh! No! No, it's a cold. Yeah. It's like... Okay, so it's not a strong cold, but it lingers. Did you have to let it linger? Yeah. Yeah. Naked melons. <laughs> Fuzzy Toby. <laughs> I don't know, these bugs lately, they like to stay longer than they should. Because <coughs> let's just think about it. Remember when I got, I was, I had that stomach problem in the motel? That was like 10 fucking days. I know. Of me throwing up and, and shitting and it was awful. 10 fucking days of that. Serious. Now this cold we've had for about maybe a month and a half now. Yeah. Like things lately just last longer, these bugs. It's true. It's fucking weird. It's like why are bugs lasting longer? I don't know, ever since, ever since, like, we got COVID the first time, like, sicknesses last, are, just last. Mm -hmm. You've noticed that? I've never felt 100% right since then. Neither have I. My taste. Yeah, my taste is very it's, different. And my smell is not the same. Me too. 
anyone else who got COVID, is your taste and smell back 100% or is it different still? Like your tongue is numb on like a constant basis or something. I know, right? <coughs> really weird. Oh. The migraine that comes with this. You know what we should watch? What? Today. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. We should watch Mike Matai do all of fucking Red Dead. If that's what you want to do. Yeah, bro. And I, I, I'm very happy that you want to watch Mike. I never got it, never caught it. Luckies! Lucky. That's all I have to say, is lucky. No. The next thing I need is 75 wood. I don't have the money. I can't do it. Never mind. I'll just work on my fucking farm. God damn it. Alright. Get over here, you son of a bitch. Praise God, I'm in remission. Praise God! Yeah, that's great. That's gotta be a good feeling. Is being in remission? Yeah. That's gotta be like the best day ever feeling. You know, when SpongeBob is like, it's the best day ever! I'll have all the green beans in the back. Hey, this is looking nice. Definitely. Now we need five for cauliflower. There's weird sounds today, or am I just getting paranoid and shit? The cat's eating. Oh, that's what it is! <laughs> Holy crap! You thought someone else was out in the kitchen? I thought there was, yeah. <coughs> I swear to God, honey. My imagination's getting the best of me today, man. Oh, I get that stuff, too.
We're okay, Great Scott's. How are you? Man, Great Scott's Diner. Remember that? Oh, my God, oh. dude. Oh, my God. So good. That was awesome. We are like Dank and Dabby. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I say we do the Dank and Dabby show. Just redo it. That's That was a suggestion of mine. Tell you the truth, I am like obsessed with wanting to watch uh, Deep Space Nine. I'll be honest. Yeah, it's a great show. Are you obsessed with that too? Uh, obsessed? I don't know about that. Yeah. I can get obsessed with it though. It's a very good show. Well, I'm almost done with Sunday work, so here on the farm. That was my main intention, is like doing this game and taking it to Sunday and then going off stream and then watching something with you. And... Mm -hmm. But it's almost done. Holy crap. Oh, ooh, ooh, oh. Look at that beautiful gem right there. Like, how big do you think this farm is going to get? Mm. We're going to find out. I guess we'll find out on the next episode of, you know, the Stardew Valley. You know? How far did Shani get on her off time while she's watching, <clears throat> you know, Deep Space Nine? We're going to find out on that, folks. Like, this definitely, this area needs a path. But basically, what I'm going to do while I'm off stream is I'm going to try to eliminate all these trees, all the stones, and keep working on this garden while doing the Sunday challenge today. And I'll show you how far I get tomorrow on Stardew Valley. Me, I'm I'm checking out. I have to in probably two hours I will be getting a message from the boyos to do a certain something with them. So I'm taking off. I'll watch some Deep Space Nine. Watch some Deep Space Nine too. We're on the fourth season. Start watching the fourth season and we could talk about it. So peace and Maranatha, guys. I will be on a little later. And it will be a talking stream, not a gaming stream. Bye, guys.